Hey, welcome back, everybody. You're tuning in to DraftingTutorials.com. My name is Casey Kepley, and uh, in today's video, I'm going to be covering uh, the topic of area and how to find square footage within a object or, say, like a floor plan or a structure, like a house. So what we have here is just a basic outline of the uh, exterior wall on a floor plan, and I'm going to show you how to find the area. So you go up to the command and type area. Now there's two ways to do this. You can go by adding area and if you select that option it's going to allow you to select the endpoints on the interior or exterior of your floor plan. So you can just kind of go around it like this on all endpoints. And you'll see the green is highlighted area that you're going to measure. So you, after you're done, you just hit enter. <coughs> and it gives you the area. Um, along with the perimeter and your total area. So that's one way to do it. The other way you can do it is to go ahead and join all your lines so that they become one object. As you can see here, they're all joined. You can go to the area command, type in area and then select object and you can select just one object and it'll it'll give you the area there as well so that's the two ways you can calculate area there's another portion to area that we're not going to cover today but it would be adding and subtracting area so you may have like um, an object within the uh, structure here or the floor plan so you may have like a, a round table and you want to calculate the area around the table. Um, so you would use the add and subtract. I'll cover that in a different video, but for today, that is how you would find area and perimeter of an object. All right. Um, if you like what you're seeing, go ahead and hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and uh, I'll be sure to shoot some more videos here soon for you. Uh, until then, you guys have a good day, and I'll talk to you later.